Hello friends, I hope you're all doing well today. Today we're going to be opening some Vivid Voltage. I'm super excited about it. I've had this for a while. I've had a lot of my stuff sitting around for a while and I just, you know, there's so much to open. So I'm hoping, obviously we can get the Chunky Pikachu. You know, we need some of this stuff that I don't have yet. I still have some amazing rares I need to get. I have a lot of stuff from this set I still want. So this comes with eight packs, no promo card. We're hoping to get this chunky Pikachu, either the normal one or the rainbow. It comes with some sleeves, you know, some dice, all the good stuff. So the Elite Trainer boxes are really good because you get a bunch of stuff with it. Some sleeves to keep your cards nice and safe. And they're just really fun to open. So let's get on to it. I hope you're all doing well. Get comfy. Enjoy. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it so much. Let's get to it. So this is going to be a bit of a shorter video since there's only eight packs in here, but I feel like I've been giving you fairly long videos, so I think it's time for a shorter one, right? What do you think? <laughs> We've got to switch it up a little bit. So there's only eight packs in this, like I said. I'm hoping we can get an amazing rare. Um, you know, any full arts that I currently don't have, which is a decent bit of them. Some... Um, some Pikachu, please. So it comes with this nice little book. It's a player's guide if you want to learn how to actually play the TCG. It shows you a bunch of just the cards that are in here. You can even do a little checklist of what you have and what you don't. So uh, yeah, we're just trying to get the Pikachu. There's also some gold cards that I want. This boy. Yeah. So it comes in this nice packaging, which I personally love when they, I don't know, the themed packaging is just really nice. Uh, it comes with this rules book, if you want to learn, again, how to play. These are card dividers, so you can keep all your cards in here after. Just a pack of energies, nothing too exciting. We got some sleeves, though, so that's nice. Always nice to have some sleeves. We got eight, eight packs. And then it also comes with, if you are looking to play this game, you know, IRL, um, dice, and these are like the damage counters type things. I keep forgetting what they're called, but you know, you get it. <laughs> you got it. So I'm just going to keep this over here, keep it nice and safe. Let's get to opening. Pack number one, starting off with Celebi. So Celebi is... The amazing rare I have the most of. I have three, <laughs> three amazing rare Celebes. So I'm really hoping that, geez, this will not come apart. I'm really hoping we do not get a Celebi amazing rare. I mean, listen, I'll take any amazing rare, but I just, I would love to get ones that I don't currently have. And as I said, I have a million Celebi, so I would love to get the Rayquaza. There's also the, um, what else is there? Jirachi, I think. So, Matang. We got a giraffe rig. Also, I really love the art in this set. I love opening Vivid Voltage. The art is so pretty. Like, look at this. It just follows the whole theme of just being bright and beautiful. And I love it. Little mud bray, just rolling in the mud. I actually used to ride horses. I owned a horse for a while. And let me tell you giving your horse a bath, and then putting it out in the field for it to just... <gasps> okay! <laughs> wow! First pack, and we got a Zacian Amazing Rare and a Zygarde Hollow. I do not have this one. I think I have Zamazenta, so... What? Pack number one? I really wasn't expecting that. <laughs> and the Zygarde Hollow. Wow, that's so exciting! Look at that! One thing I love about the Amazing Rares is not only how beautiful the rainbow is, but look at the, um, like the typings and the energies. And even this sparkles, like everything sparkles. It's so pretty. Wow, that's nuts! Okay, pack number one coming through. We take those! <laughs> I don't even remember what I was saying before, but... <laughs> That just kind of like shook me a little bit because I, I thought that I just pulled up a random card and I thought the next one was the reverse hollow. And that just wasn't the case. That's, that's not what happened. 
We definitely take those. Let's go. All right, got some water energy. We got a little Bia. I love her. Dua. This is such pretty art. I really love like this watercolor looking art. Uh, maybe it's not watercolor. It kind of looks watercolory though. But it just this is like my some of my favorite art just in the Pokemon TCG in general, and also like the cute art, obviously. But something about the watercolors is just so pretty. Wow, we're getting like the same pack. We this is like the same pack. Reverse Hollow Wind in Stadium, and we got a Clefable. Look at that Clefable art. How cute! How cute! I love the art in this man. This set is so good. Like, if you haven't gotten any Vivid Voltage, I know it's still hard to find. It's hard to find around me. Honestly, I can't find any cards around me, which makes me really sad. We're really struggling to find, like, anything. But if you can't get your hands on some Vivid Voltage, do it. If you haven't opened it yet, there's so many good cards and beautiful artwork. I love the set. It's amazing. Definitely get some for yourself. Reverse Hollow Execute. And a Colossal V. Cute. I think I have this one already. But we take those. Look at him. Hey, this is, you know, this is going pretty well so far. I hope that's not all of our luck for this ETB, though. <laughs> I'm really hoping we can get a Pikachu at some point. I just, I want to be in the Chunky Pikachu Club. Give it to me. <laughs> Come on, I love Pikachu. I need it. Fighting. Loudrin. Oops, geez. Wind in Stadium. Zeb Striker. Very cute. Dedenne. Drillbur. Oshawa, the baby. Duskull. Got a fair seed. Reverse Hollow Genesect. That art's pretty cool, actually. And a Hollow Zapdos. Look at that. So pretty. I love Zapdos. All the birds are great. They're all beautiful. Um, there we go. Metal. This is metal, right? Not steel. Sableye. Cramorant. Kakuna, Cottony, one of the cutest babies ever. Aracuda, wait, that's the Cramorant that was just eating. <laughs> that's the card I got like two seconds ago. <laughs> he got him out of the water and he's eating him. <laughs> Luciana, reverse hollow Metagross. This Metagross art is really pretty, but it's also creepy. <laughs> and Lucario, I love this art. See this one I'm talking about like the watercolor looking art? It's so pretty. Huge fan. I'm hoping we can get a full art out of this. Or, I mean, I would be okay with another amazing rare. Obviously, one I don't have would be ideal. But you never know. Alright, so we got some water. Barathorn, look at that cutie. He's kind of creepy, but like, I don't know, something about him is just a little cute. He's just kind of grumpy, and we take that. We like it. Go, go. Careless. Galarian Meowth. Okay, how many of y'all like Galarian Meowth? Are you a fan? Are you not a fan? Let me know down below, because I'm curious. Got a Cottony. Aracuda. Was about to get eaten. <laughs> and Kata. Oh my god, I'm pulling up all the cards. Pick a peck. Reverse Hollow Dusclops. Ooh, I don't actually know if I have this or not. That's really cool art, though. It's kind of scary. <gasps> and an Orbeetle V Max. Look at that. Wow, we're getting pretty lucky. We have two packs left still. All right, I take that. Like, he's. <laughs> He's a flying saucer. I think that's such a cool idea for Orbeetle. Just to make it like, you know, like a spaceship. Very creative. Huge fan. Huge fan. I always think that I'm messing it up and I'm putting an extra card. And it makes me so nervous. I'm like, oh my god, I put an extra card. <laughs> Glaring Stunfisk, probably one of my least favorite Pokemon. It's also like 
a bear trap and we don't like bear traps around here okay let them live in their own environment and be safe because we don't want to hurt any little bears. Ah, oh, look at the Charmander. Such cute art. I love it. And a whooper with all the rainbows and the bubbles. And oh, is that a Whalmer in there? Never noticed that. <laughs> Clear in meow. Reverse hollow dust skull. And a bee drill. I don't like bees, but I kind of like bee drill. He's the cutie. He is a cutie, friends. By the way, this is our last pack of this. If you're not following, or I guess if you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, it'd mean the world if you'd sub. Uh, my previous video, we just did one for our 300 subscriber, sort of like a mini celebration. I opened a bunch of Pikachu and Eevee themed, um, you know, a bunch of Pikachu and Eevee themed boxes and tins. So definitely go check it out. I'm going to link it at the top. But it would mean the world to me if you'd subscribe to the channel. Just because we are hit, trying to hit 500. You know. That's sort of my little goal for right now. Look at this two cannon. I love those flowers. That's really pretty. I actually never really took the time to look at this. Oops. I just, I spoiled it. A Tornadus. This guy looks like he deserves to be in Dragon Ball Z. I have... I don't think I have this card, but he's like a Dragon Ball Z character. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching today, friends. I appreciate it so much. Uh, like I said, I'm going to link my previous video right above on the top right. If you haven't watched it, go check it out. I opened a bunch of Pikachu and Eevee themed... Uh, boxes and tins and I got some okay stuff I will say some stuff I definitely didn't have before which is the best <laughs> and if you're not subscribed to the channel what are you doing <laughs> subscribe to the channel it would mean the world to me turn on the little notification bell you know slap that like as they say <laughs> um, I really am trying to get to 500 subscribers it's our new goal I'm gonna do a live stream opening a vivid voltage booster box if you're interested in that, I'm going to do it on my Twitch channel. It'll be a ton of fun. And we can hang out there. We can all chat together. It'll go on YouTube after. But I really want to open this booster box I have just sitting here waiting to be open. It's, it's yelling at me. <laughs> I'm going to be posting videos every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday for the most part. That's my goal for now. I'm going to be trying to stream at least three times a week on some days during Wednesday through Sunday. So no set schedule, but it'll all be early morning, afternoon stuff. So I hope to see you on Twitch. I hope that you'll subscribe here. Maybe, you know, check out more of my videos. I would really appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Thank you so much for giving me the time of day. Thanks for hanging out, getting comfy and cozy. Until next time, friends.